Kai from Houston. I'm still in Houston. If you're watching the replay, drop hashtag replay. It's Jess. I hope you guys have had fun watching my adventures the past couple days. I'll be in town for tomorrow. I hop in a car and I um, drive back to Austin area and fly out back to Florida on uh, Monday, Monday afternoon. So if you're watching, give me some hearts so I know that you can hear me. I don't see any kind of interact. I don't even know if it went live. So if you can hear me, say hi. Hi guys. Hello, 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 hello. Facebook, are you allowing me to talk to people? <laughs> oh, it was being weird earlier today. It was being very, very weird. So I'm not sure if it's working. But we're just going to talk and if it doesn't work, oh well. Oh well. So what is today? Today is Saturday. Um, I came to, a lot of people were like, well, why are, what are you doing? Hi, Yvette, Hi, can you hear me? Can someone give me some hearts if you can hear me? Um, you know what, maybe I can't see comments. Let's see, I just reset it. Can you guys hear me? Yes, thank you, okay. All right, so um, a lot of people were like, what are you doing? in Houston. I've never been to Houston. I've never been to Texas. And um, I came here because uh, to, today we have a Mavens and Gems uh, holiday party. And it was going to be last month. And uh, we ended up bumping it. And I'm like, well, wait a second, I could probably go. And it turns out, long story short, I'm here. And I think it's about seven o'clock people are gonna be here, maybe a little bit early if we're, um, they're coming from Austin. But I'm super excited to mingle and um, actually meet some people that I have yet to actually meet. You work with online, you know, on Facebook and Messenger or however, working the business. Um, but it's like the same, same atmosphere or same thing as like when you go to a convention or you know any kind of meetup and you meet these people that you've grown to really, really like become good friends with, um, all because of this business. And I'm here, I'm here because of two, over two years ago, I was in a place where, you know, I was after I had Emma and I was nursing her and I wasn't feeling myself. I was like hormones, it was bad, PPD, very bad. Um, and um, it was, I just needed some, I was watching my, um, some children and some, you know, my, my daughters and I was, you know, that mom funk kind of thing. I was depressed, all that kind of stuff. Um, I don't really dive, talk too much about it because I'm not there anymore. But I understand that, that, that me, you know, doing this or thinking maybe I wanted to do this was maybe going to help me. Maybe it was attractive. It was something that it wasn't that, um, I don't know. It was just something, you know? Uh, it, unless, unless you're in the situation, it's, you know, you're really not going to understand. But if you're watching and you, you're in that situation, then you know what I'm talking about. Um, and what I love about this is that, um, yes, that's my, you know, reason. And that's, you know, why I started. It's not why I continue to do it. Um, I'm, I'm obsessed with it. Hey, Kimberly, I'm so excited to see you. I'm obsessed with um, just seeing the transformation in people, the sisterhood, the, how cool is it? How cool is it? You know, um, especially as you grow up and you, you're an adult and um, you're busy with life and it's hard to make friends, right? It's hard to make friends and just have a social life. And, um, and it's awkward and it can be like, you know, it's not like when you're younger and, and you're having play dates and you're going to school and you're in that environment and you're forced to sit and do projects with people, you know? Um, you know, and so no matter where, because um, there's so many different, you know, I, I, it, I am stay-at-home mom kind of thing. I don't work outside the home, um, but Nicole... You know, she's completely opposite. She's a single mom and she's a full-time career woman and she made this work into her life and different personalities and, and different reasons and, and how it's transformed people. It's just amazing. I'm super excited. Um, so I'm, I'm, it's hard to, it's hard to talk about it sometimes, you know, it can, um, cause it's a lot of feelings, uh, cause it's very personal and, um, 
and it becomes more than just you, you know, because you personally invest yourself into other people. So, um, I don't know. So that's a little bit why I'm here and what's happening today. So I'm so excited to see a lot of you tonight. Um, if you're in the area, come on, hop on a bus and, and come. I know, um, I know maybe two of my girls are coming, but even, even some of the maidens, we're all, you know, we're all Y sisters and we're all in this business for whatever reason, um, either to make money or to get out of my funk, um, or to just, I don't know. It, you, it, this has totally helped me rediscover myself or what I like or, or what I needed and um, ha totally makes me feel very grateful and a lot of gratitude for um, just my life and um, the people in my life. And, and it's not because of this only, but it's just helped me grow as a person um, because that's another thing too. You wish mama needs a vacation. Hey, I didn't think, okay, so I looked on this day on in uh, Facebook, and it was yesterday, the day before, and I saw pictures of last year's party, and they had my big head, because for the year before, I sent her a big face of, you know, my face, a big head <laughs> for her birthday, and so she put my face on a mannequin, and she, as if I was there, and uh, so it was really cool, and then she did something really awesome to where she wrote, like, had everybody write notes, inspiring notes, and just really, and she put it in a jar, and she shipped it to Florida, and I had opened a few of them, uh, but I, I hadn't, and, you know, read all of them, uh, I, I don't know why, I don't know, life or I don't know, uh, but come June or June or May of la this past year when I was working for the incentive and I was like, you know, oh my gosh, you know, for a PC, which we totally earned, um, I was able to take my husband on that incentive trip. But uh, I sat down, I think it was in my VIP group, I sat down with some wine and I opened on live and I read everything. And these people I hadn't met. And um, to be now, a year later in house in Texas to meet these people some of which are new some of them are you know from last year too it's just strange it's freaking awesome it's really awesome it's exciting and um, and it's like rainbows and unicorns and <laughs> um, at the business aspect I've been in it for over two years and I've learned so much and I continue to grow. That's a big thing. You have to be willing to try new things, uncomfortable things to see what works for you because what works for me is not going to work for another person. Um, but there are systems in place that, you know, for training, all that kind of stuff. Um, but it is you, you know, uh, it's, it's your journey. It's your, you know, your business, you do whatever the, <laughs> whatever you want with it. Um, and it, and it does change and it does evolve, um, just along with you. Um, and that's exciting. That's exciting. Um, such a cute idea. Isn't that a cute idea? It was so random, so random. And, and I remember this jar was huge. It was one of those really huge mason jars and the box was small. So it had a big bump on it. <laughs> I don't know. I just wanted to pop on. I just finished getting ready and, and I used lip sparkle on top of unfazed, which is the gray. So I was like, totally goes with the theme. I'm, I'm a little loud right now, but I don't care. I'm a little loud. Um, because I just wanted to be like fun and bright right now. Uh, she's actually went to the gym with her son and I was getting ready and I'm like, let me go live and just talk a little bit about today and what today is and what this business sort of means to me. It's, it's impossible to talk about it, you know, in a short amount of time. And, and there's so many different little things that it's brought into my life. And, um, and I know I talk to a lot of people about, oh, you should, you would be great at this, or this would be perfect for you. And, and you have that like, yeah, whatever. Or like, I could never do that. And, um, I just see what it's done for me and what it's done for other women and, or people, because there are men in this business too. Um, you don't have to know what you're doing at all. Uh, it's so much fun. Uh, and it can be whatever, the, whatever you want. And it's, it's put me here, which is so absurd. <laughs> it's so absurd. Uh, going, getting tattoos and going, oh my gosh. So last night was so fun. If you're, if you haven't watched my uh, stories, click on my stories. We went to this place that's called Studio 80s and she's like, oh, let's go here and let's go dance. I'm like, okay. And she goes, yeah, it's all 80s. I'm like, is it like 80s night? Cause where I'm from. I'm from Florida. Yeah, there's clubs, there's dancing, you know, kind of thing. Um, and they have like an 80s night or a theme. 
This is dedicated 24 seven, whenever it's open, whenever it's open, it's full on 80s. And you go into that place, it's like a time bubble. <laughs> and, um, and it's like serious business, you know? It's like, I legit, like, I, I was like, I don't know. I, I'm still digesting it, and and there was uh, Michael Michael um, battle, and and then occasionally see my time because well, how old am I? I'm 84, baby. So my time, I love 90s, you know, 90s R&B, hip hop, dance, what that kind of club kind of music. So 80s, that you know, 80s rock, and I mean, I can I can you know hang out, but that's not my jam. There was one. What did we get up and dance? I danced to one song uh, with with uh, Nicole. Damn, what song did we dance? It was, I forgot what song. <laughs> if you really want to know, message me and I'll ask Nicole, she'll probably remember. And then it went straight to, and I'm proud to be an American. I'm like, wow. So the DJ wasn't that great, but it was funky and it was fun and it was really entertaining. Um, and I had never been to a place like that uh, before. Cause like I said, it's usually like a one night theme, not a 24 seven, this is, solely to 80s music and and the decor and all that kind of stuff so it was really fun um and then earlier in the day she took me to an amazing place i don't remember what it was called mariah's oh my gosh if you're ever in dickinson uh in uh texas go to this place it is beautiful uh and it's all the senses you know it's all the senses hi ashley um taste buds the food is amazing it's like occasion sort of but I don't, I don't know. I'm, I don't really know the, the name, of it, but it was really, really delicious food. Uh, so the smells and the taste buds were amazing. But then the atmosphere at the bar, we were on freaking swings. Have you, I've never been to a, a bar that had swings uh, and it was a wood and it was so nice. And just and then there was different um, places, more like a chandelier and very high end, and then that, and then downstairs it was more like um, pirate kind of thing, but not like weird pirate kind of thing, but more casual. It was amazing. I was so happy. I was like, this is so nice. <laughs> and um, so I'm thankful. I'm, I'm I'm thankful for my husband. I'm thankful for Nicole for two things. For two, for for one, oh, I'm actually two people for one huge reason, because I I don't do things for myself, you know I don't, and that's normal, right? I don't do things for myself, and I'm I I'm very concerned how what what I want or what I want to do or affects other people instead of just like doing whatever I want, you know? And um, so they've, they've been really good people in my life to be like, enjoy yourself, do. And I know that there's a lot of other people that, I've, that have been in my life um, more recently that have served, you know, have, have reminded me to. So I'm, I'm so thankful of, you know, the constant growth. And I haven't really shown you guys, and this was my tattoo. Of course, if you if you make a bestie and you go into this business, I can't guarantee you're gonna find one like mine, but you might. And you might not wanna get matching tattoos, that's okay. Um, but I got a second tattoo, and this is sort of upside down. But it means um, six different things, and it's like a, a hieroglyphics, like glyphs, and um, learning it's really hard to do but i can i can put a picture if you want more information or you want to see it uh, it's really really neat and i'm and the guy was amazing um so we've done a lot of little things and i'm not even done yet so i've been rambling like crazy so if you watch this whole thing you're awesome <laughs> and you're my people <laughs> I hope you guys have a great Saturday. If you have any questions about anything, please don't hesitate to ask me. Now I know a little bit about Texas, so I can recommend some fun things if you're ever in the area. Um, FYI, the beach is not that amazing, but it's a beach and it's nothing like Florida. <laughs> but I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. Love you guys.